unit and piece are fundamental for a country's stability and development. They create a conducive environment for economic growth and social progress. One of President Hagendichlema's key pillars of governance include peace building in the country, hence his statement that for citizens to realize their full potential, they first must feel safe and secure. This is the same message being preached by the House of Chiefs in Northwestern Province. We cannot allow our country to be divided and divided and divided. Whether it's on tribe, whether it's on this, whether it's on politics, no, we only have one country. These issues, as they come, we shall resolve them. The only mistake we'll do is to take a Many are trying to take a political leverage. No, we can't toy around with peace like that. The chief also spoke about issues relating to mines in the province. I'm praying that after your visit, we shall hear of the opening of Kasenseri. Kasenseri was a game changer in Mwinirunga. Brought about the economy, suddenly everybody had money, and with the closure of Kasenseri, all the money disappeared. And I think that that is the continued closure of Kasenseri is perpetuating poverty. I'm also, I would also say, Honorable Minister, the long standing matter of Kalingwa Mai, we need Kalingwa opened. And we need Kalingwa opened, but opened under the right hands. We know who won Kalingwa. Chief Mumena said this when Lands and Natural Resources Minister Elijah Mchima called on him at his palace. This issue of displacing people, that's when an investor comes with the money. The paper is signed without regard to the people's settlements. Next they are in court being displaced. We are saying in this government, no. There should be maybe a, a trust in the kingdom. We want to know who is who. When it's given, he comes to the chief, the size is given, it's known by the owners. We want respect to go to the owners of the land. At independence, late Zambian president Dr. Kenneth Kaunda coined the political ideology slogan of One Zambia, One Nation to unite the country's 73 ethnic tribes and encourage them to live side by side in one national boundary called Zambia today. Kalan. Mochima reporting.